Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody left me a message on one of the videos asking if they have a rectangle in a circle. And if you select the rectangle first, hold down the shift key, select the circle and hit T as in Tom on your keyboard, it puts it to the top. But they want the bottom of the rectangle to the top. So there's two ways, two easy ways to do this. One of them, let's make our rectangle six by six and set our nudge factor on six inches. So what we did, we put it in the center of the page. Everything's in the center of the page. So we're going to select our rectangle, hold down the shift, select the circle second and hit T. The reason for that in that order, if you select the rect or the circle first and then the rectangle and you hit T, it's going to be the, bring the circle down and not the rectangle up. So once we have the rectangle to the top, our nudge factor is set on six inches. We can select our rectangle and just hit the up arrow key and it'll be at the very edge of the ellipse or the circle. Now the other way to do that, and it's almost as easy, is to mirror it. But to do that, you have to change your object origin to the top node in the center and then when you mirror it it will put it to the top that's very helpful but i would always change mine back after i did that to the center because most of the time you're going to do it to the center anyway i hope that helped a little bit thank you for watching